Well, most areas still seeing those cloudy skies right now, but in a few spots, I showed you uh, the warm weather camera and also I showed you the airport weather camera. The clouds starting to clear out, so we're going to see some sunshine late this morning into the afternoon. Grove City College weather camera still cloudy there, and you can still see these brown spots in the Greenway. Of course, did get some rain overnight into this morning that should help out somewhat with that, and so uh, that is certainly some good news. Now, as far as these temperatures go, still right around 60 degrees, but with the sunshine, that's about to happen. We're going to see those warm up a little bit. Cold front pushing the clouds out of the area for now. So we're going to have this brief break here where we see some sunshine and then uh, another part of this storm system back here in the uh, western and the central part of the country will bring more chances for clouds and showers as we head into the weekend. The clouds, you can see those clearing out here by 2 o'clock. A good bit of sunshine. Temperatures in the upper 60s and low 70s. We're somehow going to have another above average temperature day. It didn't really look possible earlier this week, but uh, these uh, uh, temperatures will rise into the low 70s. Like I mentioned, there's a secondary cold front that drops through here uh, later on this afternoon and evening that will trigger a couple of these showers. Now, not every single location will see rain, uh, but just don't be surprised if you see a few more of these raindrops. Then later on tonight, things begin to clear out some, though uh, temperatures dropping back off into the mid 50s. So tonight's definitely going to be colder. Expect those temperatures to drop into the 40s uh, by daybreak. So today's high temperature 71. The chance of some showers once again showing up in the afternoon afternoon and evening and then especially as we head into the day tomorrow this is a future tracker here Another round of showers comes through uh, for tomorrow morning, and then I believe we'll clear out for a time. Okay, so we'll see a little bit of sunshine again tomorrow morning. A lake effect rain shower band gets going, though, and that starts to drift off into Trumbull County by about noon and into the rest of the valley kind of throughout uh, the afternoon. So it's not going to be completely cloudy tomorrow. There will be periods of clouds and sun, but then there's going to be uh, multiple rounds of showers that kind of pass through our area tomorrow afternoon throughout the evening tomorrow. So that will certainly be something to watch out for. Rain chances highest up here in the snow belt areas along and north of I-80. About a 50% chance, 60% chance up there. 30 to 40 almost every single other location uh, for tomorrow. YSU weather game, or I'm sorry, <laughs> excuse me, YSU football game is tomorrow and the weather for that is certainly going to be a little colder than what we have been seeing. Kickoff is at 6 o'clock, 50 degrees at kickoff, dropping into the 40s throughout the game with the chances for some showers. Seven-day outlook shows the dreary weather continues into Sunday and Monday, Dries out a little bit Tuesday and Wednesday before another round of some rain showers shows back up on 